What's going on guys? It is your boy Tor Crunch and today we've got uh, a nice little video that I think uh, will be nice to make finally uh, after several months. So for the, for the few of you guys that don't know, I do have a Road to Glory, which is this account right here, um, which I started three months ago actually. I think it's on the dot. And uh, well basically I created an account without with the rules being no spending money and just basically playing a free to play account all farm legit orbs and everything so basically uh what you guys see here is that the result of that and we're just going to be taking a look at all my units all my accessories and where i'm at currently and uh, yeah this is episode 19 and i'm actually unfortunately going to be ending this series to uh, the next episode on episode 20 which is going to be kind of a little special vid uh, stream actually for you guys so i'll explain why i'm ending it at the end of this video but for now let's go ahead and take a look at the units we've got we'll start off with uh, technique and then we'll move on from there but um yeah right here as you guys see we've got ourselves Yamamoto, Biakuya, Riruka, uh, Valentine's Momo, Christmas Kisuke, Frenzy Renji and then uh, Kensei five-star version and Yamamoto five-star version so a bunch of characters, right? I mean, not not a bunch. I'm not. I take that back. Not a bunch of characters, but uh, pretty good characters with the few that we do have. Of course, some of them or the best ones aren't maxed out, which are Yamamoto and Biakuya. I still need to max them out, but those are two good units. You know, I know uh, Biakuya gets a lot of shit for not being that great, but he's still a good character nonetheless. Of course, if he had Frenzy, he'd be ten times better. He'd probably be like top ten in the game, but. Um, Biakuya and Yamamoto are my standouts. Riruka is still a good character, but Yamamoto is by far my best one. And I'm actually happy with where I'm at right now. This account is actually looking pretty nice. I, I do uh, I do like it. Um, I st still only need to max out a few more uh, five-star versions, which of course is Kensei and Yamamoto. You know, evolve them to six-star and then I'll max them out. Momo, I'm still currently doing that on. But, you know, I think for, uh, what is it, 90 days? I think we're at a pretty nice spot place to in terms of technique characters it's not my best attribute but it's still a good place to be at so let's go ahead and take a look at this dude my i don't know for whatever reason the the capture the capturing of the screen is a little slow but we're where we, we are where we need to be at so it's okay um here i think uh it's slightly a better attribute which is my heart version so looking at it i do have retsu which is arguably the best character in the whole game so i'm definitely happy with her as a character the rest, though, they're kind of subpar now. Tag Team Renji's actually not all that bad because he's, he's he's still got relatively decent stats and skills. Um, the, the 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 dog, the PVP character that you can get from PVP, he's he's not good, right? Obviously, but Sukishima, he's an all right character. He still heals and all that, so he has some positives to him. Uh, that Renji, of course, you get for free from playing the game. Biakuya, that's the oldest version you can get. That guy's been around forever. He's on basically everyone's account. Frenzy, uh, Yoroichi is actually a really nice, um, what is it, Frenzy character. I really, really like this, uh, the, the the recharge time and strong attack damage. So, of course, I really like this Frenzy character. Um, and then, of course, we've got a five-star version, ver virgin, <laughs> whoa, a five-star version of Renji, tag team Renji. So, I still have him. I've got Stark. I've got um, White, Vastalorde, whatever you want to call him. Super cool. Straight is still a really good character with probably one of my favorite specials. And then we've got another Tsukishima. So we've got pretty good characters. Of course, Retsu's the best, but Renji, Stark, you know, White, uh, Vastalorde, those are still good characters that I think, um, yeah, I'd still, I I'm still working on. So I'm still going to get them to, you know, level 200. And then moving on, that is our heart character. So we're moving on to power now. This one's probably my most stacked out of them all. Um, just because, yeah, I've got a lot of really good top tier characters for that attribute. Once my screen loads, what is going on today, dude? There we go. Wow, I, I don't know what's going on. But anyways, we've got Yin and Yang, which is my most recent pull. Which is a really good normal attack damage character. Probably the best at this time. Maybe not the best, but second for sure. Oh, okay. This is probably what it is. Later. We'll do that later. Remind me later. God damn it. I'm making a freaking video, Apple. Yin and Yang. Still need to max him out, but, you know, it's a, a great normal attack damage character. Yeah, Yachiru is surprisingly a fun and pretty good character to use. Right now, currently on Guild Quest, the best attribute to use or the attribute you want to use is power. So, 
I've been actually using her just to clear out rooms with her special because she's got bombardment. Uh, if I'm if I am correct, I do believe she's got bombardment, which is really strong, and you can basically clear a room if you got attention tie. Just slap attention tie and it's over. But um, we've got um, PVP character and then Toshiro Uryu. Re, re, uh, Rukia, the power version, which is 14 recharge time, which I need to level up. So, yeah, overall, man, great characters. Um, I think this is my bad, best at, at, attribute. And um, I'm still working on actually getting Noitora done. So that's another great character, probably. He's probably the best normal attack damage character still. But, yeah, I still got to work on him. I've got three of them, actually. Toshiro. Uh, yeah, I guess I can use him to max him out. But he's not anything extraordinary, you know. Uh, but yeah, that's that's power. Like I said, I think power might be one of my strongest attributes. Um, and I mean, with all those characters, yeah, it's going to be one of my best character or attributes. So anyways, moving on. Speed attribute. We've got ourselves uh, Yoruichi, so, so, uh, Kakao Society, which is actually a really good character. I really like her. Um, we've got Shunsu, which, which I still need to max out. But I do have all the Frenzy characters now. So I'm going to do that probably off screen uh, after this video or something. And we've got Yukio. Biakuya, the speed version. Gen, which is from White Day. We've got Christmas. Um, oh, no. Don't. don't. Oh, did I really forget her name just now? I, it's uh, Hiyori. There you go. There you go. Hiyori. We've got ourselves Christmas Hiyori, which is a pretty cute character. You can't you can't sit here and lie and tell me to my face that that's not a cute version of Hiyori. Um, there's uh, freaking Grimjow, which is the first version, which isn't the greatest. Um, he was at one point, but not anymore. Soifon, which is kind of trash. Really, she is trash. And then we've got Jushiro and then another again. So, you know, speed is looking pretty good. I would say it's definitely not the worst, but it isn't the best. So it's kind of in the middle. And then um, last attribute is mind. And this one is actually quite stacked, but I have not worked on it whatsoever. There's so much progress that I need to make on it. But we still have really good characters. So, for example, Kenpachi, Bankai Kenpachi, great character, awesome, like, PvP character. If you didn't notice, I actually do have all the, the manga characters uh, because I also have Sejin, which is a great normal attack damage character. I, I actually do think he's a little... <sighs> he's uh, underwhelming now a little just because of Retsu. She just demolishes him any any like in any way. She's just going to win 90% of the time. So probably higher than 90%. But yeah, we've got Grimjow, which is a good character. We've got that Crystal Link Akon, which is great. And then we've got Frenzy Zalapur, which is good. We've also got Frenzy Grimjow, which I don't think I got all the crystals for, which I do think. I think the Frenzy uh, event is out where you can actually max him out. So I'm going to get on that. I've got uh, Genjo, which is, you know, uh, he's a decent character. He's still, I think, be I believe he still has, like, the highest defense in the game, which is pretty cool. But, yeah, that basically is all I have in terms of characters. I feel like the progress has been good. I, I am actually super happy and pleased with what we've been able to accomplish on this account. Um, just so I can prove it to you guys, there we go. 90 days of, you know, this account, which is it's progress. 90 out of 100. So, we've been on this account for 90 days it's been a it's been a struggle at times, but it's mainly been just fun. It's a casual account that I've been playing on the side from my main account, um, and that has changed. And I will speak on that in just a minute after we get through our accessories. But yeah, that's basically what we've got going there. Um, if we go over here, we'll go to accessories. Let's take a look at four and five stars. I mean, we're not gonna go through each one, right? There, it's not like anything's all that great. I I feel like I honestly don't have all that great of accessories. I've got one or two accessories here and there with, with like 30 SP or 20 S. I've got more 20 SPs and 20 attacks than anything. So, um, yeah, accessories aren't that great. I don't even have a gold accessory. So, yeah, there's not much to look at in terms of accessories, I guess. I mean, this is what I've got. <laughs> I mean, accessories is, is a harder grind, I would say, than, than characters. Because characters, it's just RNG. But accessories, it's just you have to put an effort and time to get good secondary roles and stuff. So... I haven't been able to focus all that much time on here. I, I actually I do have a pretty good chappy for my mind version. Uh, let's go. Where is it at? Are you serious? Let, let, let's filter it out so you guys can see it. This. Oh wait, I don't. Then never mind. I thought I did. Do I have no? Okay, then it might be another attribute. But hey, that's what we've got going, man. In terms of accessories, nothing all that spectac spectacular. Uh, yeah, spiritual pressure. There we go. That's what. That's my best accessory, probably. 30 SP on my Yuki. 
my heart Yuki, which is actually kind of useless because I don't have a, a great strong attack damage heart character except for Renji, which I might have to try out. Hopefully one of the manga characters at the end of the month is going to be a, a strong attack damage heart character. That'd be pretty cool. But anyways, man, that's basically all I've got, man. Let's just take a look, I guess, to on our inventory. I've been farming so much just events this has been this right here the amount of hearts i have legit is all from the anniversary like a couple months ago when the aizen event was out i was farming that like crazy and this is how much i was able to get through just farming that fusions i've got a bunch of powders i've got a bunch of books i can work on accessories for for like probably like two three straight hours but it's just been me being lazy I don't have any of those material. Let's see. I've got pretty decent amount of material. So yeah, um, let me go ahead and just actually talk on why I'm ending the series. Um, so basically, if you guys didn't know, end of the month is coming and it's manga characters. So basically, I ended up um, <sighs> like trying to farm my main account and I just I can't seem to get that many orbs. So basically... I had to create or kind of make my road to glory more of a main account as well kind of like even it out between the two accounts and uh so from now on i am gonna i am gonna be spending money on this account which i've already done actually and i did forget to mention it when we were doing like the characters like me showing you guys what characters i had i did forget to mention that speed b Aquia and um what's the other one speed b Aquia and technique yamamoto those are the two character packs that you bought uh, for this month i bought them i also bought the 30 million download ticket and i also bought the beginners ticket so if you guys didn't add that all up together we have some five star tickets that i am going to be live streaming tomorrow or the day after so you guys stay tuned for that man i would actually have four but i forgot to buy the white day ticket it was one day late so that kind of sucks because I, I i wanted a shot at stark still but hey things happen but yeah, this is where we're at. We have a bit of BBS tickets. We have 475 of those premium summon tickets. Down here, if you look at my accessory tickets, I've got quite a bit of those, you know, I mean, I got quite a bit of premium accessory tickets for sure, a thousand plus. So yeah, anyways, I'm just ending the series at, for the Road to Glory at least. I mean, I can still continue calling it Road to Glory, the Road to Glory account, just so you guys have an idea and so you guys know what account I am summoning on. Maybe I, I actually will continue that on. But like the whole series and the whole premise of it, it did end. I know that people might think, oh, dude, well, that sucks because I enjoyed this series for that reason. Uh, but just understand that if I didn't do this, I'm not going to be getting any manga characters at the end of the month because my, my main account, I've only got like six, seven hundred orbs. So I kind of had to cave in and I did it. But hey, you know, <laughs> basically, if this if if this series was anything, if there was any kind of moral to the story, it's basically that at the end of the day. Free to play is never on top. It's always pay to win. And uh, yeah, I kind of have to do it, man. It's the end of the month. Manga characters most likely will come out. So I kind of have to get ready for that, dude. Anyways, let me know down below what you guys think about this account. This account is pretty stacked, man. All manga characters with three within three months. And uh, yeah, I'm actually pretty happy with where this account is at. So anyways, it's a great starting place to be at right now, right? Where I, I have characters I'm going to be... Um, farming and just getting more orbs and I'm ready to summon for the end of the month. Hopefully I can get all three, but again, if I don't, it's all good. We're going to try our best though. Anyways, thank you all so much for watching. Stay tuned for a live stream in the next coming up days, probably tomorrow, but most likely for sure in the next two days, like m just be on the lookout. Anyways, love you all. Thank you all so much for watching. RIP road to glory if you want to call it that but uh, don't worry we're coming out with some fire content just 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 wait man it's gonna be a week of just pure fire content in the next couple in the next week I guess so love you guys peace